Hi everyone, so I thought I would film my intro on my HD camera because I actually found this tutorial for you guys. Um, I found it on my webcam because I don't have a tripod, just now I'm holding this up for you guys. So I can film my intro here so you can see the makeup a little bit better. Um, what is up in my hair doing? It's like sticking out. Um, so it's just sort of like a nice look for spring. It's really natural I guess but then you've got that crazy pop colour underneath your eye I can't get this light on this obstruct oh, turn my hair down I was doing it the wrong way <laughs> um but yeah so I filmed this it didn't take long to do at all the makeup's really really simple I have some close ups of it that I'll insert now Yeah, um, stay tuned if you want to see how I did this and click the thumbs up button as well and subscribe because it helps me a lot if you do subscribe. So yeah. this is the primer that I'm using, it's Too Faced Shadow Insurance and it's just the original formula. It's just a nude colour and it just dries clear on the eyes so it's perfect for any look that you want to do. I totally recommend it. This is the palette that I'm taking the highlight colour and the lid colour out of. It's a smouldering palette by Topshop and it's just the cream pearlised shadow on the end that we're using. And I'm using that on a model's own eye shading brush as well. This is the number 7 palette that I'm taking the medium brown from and the sort of medium made taupe brown. And yeah. For eyeliner I used the collection Bash Stroke Waterproof and then I also used the Maybelline Gel Liner in black as well. The Maybelline Colour Tattoo in Turquoise Forever is what I put underneath my lash, my bottom lash line as my pop of colour. And then I just added on some black mascara. Then with this orange lip gloss from Max Factor, I just applied that onto my lips. For warmth, I just used the MRC Smooth Skin Bronze Powder in Sunny. Okay, so the first thing we're going to be going to do is apply your eyeshadow base. I like to use Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I just really like it. I think it's amazing. I'm running out of mine though, and I literally take a tiny amount. And I put this all over my eyelid and up to my brow bone. Um. And the reason I'm filming on my webcam just now is because my tripod is broken so I can't film on my good camera because my tripod is broke. Um, so I'm going to take this eye shadow palette. So it's the smouldering, smoky eye palette. It's I'm taking this eye shadow palette here. It's um, one of the smoky eye palettes from Topshop and this is in the shade smouldering. It's got four different colours in it. And they're all really shimmery. So there's like a black with silver shimmer, a red, a black I think with red shimmer through it, and then like a taupe colour. But we're going to take this, which is just a really pearlized cream colour, and put that all over. Um, the eyelid and up to the brow bone as well. And I'm just using a model's own eye blending brush for this. I really like Taking this. this number seven this little palette thing it has like lip glosses and stuff in it here that had a brush there. And I'm gonna go in with this shade on the number seven. 
I blend and contour brush and this is just going to go sort of in the crease over the lid, kind of messily just place it in to add some more back in. And this brush does look all the work for you so you don't have to really do anything. Then I'm taking the dark brown colour that's in here as well on the same brush. This is going out the inner outer the inner the outer corner and then a little bit into the crease. Okay, um I did do this whole look once and like earlier I had to take it all off and start again because I used my gel liner as um my like winged out liner and it just went awful. It was so bad I had to take off like it covered half of my eyelid. <laughs> so I'm taking the collection fast stroke waterproof eyeliner and this is in black and then I'm just gonna line my lash line quite thin and then wing it out thinly. Hopefully it goes the same just like that. I have to use this mirror so close up because I can't do my eyeliner from far away. <laughs> Such good forest. Okay, then what I'm going to do is take my gel liner and use this in my waterline. I love using gel liner in my waterline because it stays here all day. Doesn't matter um what you're doing, this is not gonna budge. It's really good in night out as well because you see girls that go out at the Saturday night with their liner on and then halfway through the night it's like in here and <laughs> it looks awful. Okay. And then the blue part of this tutorial, obviously the pop colour that is under here. I don't know why I'm still showing you this. Under here you can see that. Um and this is the Maybelline New York colour tattoo 24 hour. What a 24 hour shadow? How they called? I don't know. And I have this one in turquoise forever. I just looks like this is such a nice colour. Um, and I'm taking this on a little fine brush like that. You can see I've already used it. And then Okay, and then I'm going to take some on just a bit on the tip of the brush. And continue up next to the wing of the black. I will take, like I'll show you close up and all that on my HD camera. So I don't need to try for that. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this to stay there. Okay, and then I'm just going to apply some mascara. I'm just using the black. Max Factor 2000 calories. I'm just applying a little bit of that. I'm not a lot of cloth. You already know. I. And then. Okay, I'm just going to contour a little bit as well. And that's it. Then it's so pretty. I actually love it, and it's an easy, easy way to wear blue. So yeah. Bye, guys.